In this short tutorial, I'm going to show you how to work a tubular um, cord on your tape loom. Tape loom is really good for this because uh, you can manipulate it a little bit better. So basically, work a little, a few rows of plain weave just to get established. And for a tubular, you're going to always insert your weft thread through the same side. So we'll come around, change the shed. And you need to really sort of pull it around to start off with. But you'll see I'm always going through on the same side. So in this instance, I'm going through from the right and I'm pulling and what's happening is the warp threads are starting to form a tube you can actually work some very interesting decorative um, pieces with this because you can alternate between tubular and flat sections as well which is quite nice if you want to do something a little bit uh, less traditional just losing my weft thread from my shuttle so I'm probably going to take it off altogether in a moment I'll do a few more passes just so that you can see what's happening. But as you work, the piece will twist a little. And that's perfectly ordinary. This is what to expect. And once you've, you're sort of properly established, you can sort of pull it in quite tightly and get a good form. You could, in theory, also place something um, in the middle of it whilst you're weaving, a piece of wire or something, as so long as you're sure that you get it in the middle. However, it might be easier to just insert that afterwards because you do have an opening. So that. That's how your tubular forms. And as I say, it will start to sort of twist. So you'll get a spiral of whatever design that you're working all of the way around. That. That's from the previous video. And it's a really great thing to do um, if you want to use, do lacing uh, cords, for instance. It's really good and it works great for necklace cords and bracelets and things like that as well. 